staying with snow days, this is their website. So they've got this really easy to navigate hamburger menu over here. And they've got this call to action for the store request form. I'm gonna click here and it's gonna take me to the request form. That works great as an option. We also have a few brands that put it on their store locator or where to buy page. So this is Iwan's where to buy page. If I scroll down here, right underneath their store locator, they're gonna have this call to action to make a request. I would say the most popular option is this, to have it directly under or over your store locator. We do have some brands that put it directly on their main page. As you can see here, Monty's has it on their top banner to simply click here and to request Monty's. Sticking with snow days, for your social media, you're gonna to wanna to include it on your link tree or use it as a pinned post on your Facebook or Twitter. So this way it's at the very top. So if I click here, I'm gonna be brought to a page and I can click, simply click store request form and I'm gonna be able to make that request here as well. Customers who are brought to this page can easily enter in all their information. I'm here in New Jersey, so I shop at Wegmans and I wanna see the sausage grain-free pizza bites and the veggie white pizza uh, grain-free pizza bites as well. And I can make that request in about five or 10 seconds as a shopper. From here, this is where I'm able to join your newsletter. I can also print the request form if I wanna bring this into my local store. And you can see here, we generate that custom form for you based off of the items that they've requested. Or I can share that request on social media to get all my friends and followers to also request that product. Some brands will also add their promo code. So you're gonna see that promo code here. And as we can see with this brand, they have a 15% discount off of merchandise. So I'm gonna simply copy that, click redeem now, and it's gonna take me to their merch page. This has been a quick walkthrough on how to use and set up your request forms. We look forward to you start generating these results for yourself.